Hi, this is Professor Farrow over at Farrow Academy. Uh, today I will be showing a deep half guard um, escape. I won't be doing it, but I'm going to be showing you guys it. All right. So let's get started in the deep half. So, for one, deep half. Let me turn this a bit more. All right. So right here is the battle of the knees. Okay. Just so we'll get the basics of the deep half. Her knees, if they stay up, she's she's in more control. Okay, so the person on top, Marissa, wants to keep her foot on the ground and, and all of that stuff. She wants to keep trying to get her knee to kind of mount, you know, stuff like that. that that's the type of thing she wants to do, uh, especially if she can't get a cross face and she can't sprawl. That, this is the basic one in the beginning of getting the deep half guard. Okay, so when she's in this position, bring your knees up, she's going to push the closest leg, which is going to be the right leg. She's gonna push it down, twist her knee to kind of try to mount and step up with her left leg. Okay, she's she's okay here. She's got power here. She's got she's got weight here. Uh, she really can't get moved a lot. If if Joanne on the bottom tries to move her and throw her over, it goes right into a pass. Okay, so let's go back from the beginning. So right when they get underneath. The person on top, you don't have a lot of time to, you cannot have a lot of time to make a mistake. If you make a mistake, you're, you're, you're done. One little mistake, okay? So get underneath her a little more. So what she's doing here, she's holding this leg. Okay, so that is why. So we're gonna do the whole thing she's just doing. This time we're gonna see when she grabs her left hand, she's gonna grab her hand with it as we do the same thing. So she's gonna push the closest knee down, turn her knee and lift her left leg up. Now. If she's if the person on top tries to kick the leg over, she's gonna not she's gonna prevent it. Okay, so now what the person has to do on top is just grab that sleeve, pull it across, and it should slide right in. Now she can cross face, get a good head control, right into side control. Let's do it again. So do the entry. We're gonna do the entry from like a knee shield position, and I'm just gonna have her go through it. Sets up the deep, and she goes to defend, push, turn the knee, come up, grab the sleeve, come around in side control. Good, right in a good side control. So one thing when she's in the deep, I just go in the deep half. So she, if Joanna has her arm around this leg, that's gonna be a little bit of a different story. She's gonna be looking for underhooks, you know, stuff like that she's again she could try to step over she's gonna have to sprawl get her her ear to the ground all that stuff we're gonna do in a later video um but for right now she's gonna have her arm around this leg over here your arm back. Your arm. okay so you so she this is so this is preventing her from from doing anything crazy from stepping over okay so when her knees are up what i always like to like to do is push this knee down okay but what i've been watching I'm liking to push this knee down to the ground because if she has the underhook on her foot and she elevates her, she's gonna push that foot down before that happens. If she gets elevated up in the air, she's gonna get swept. Okay, so instantly, one more time, push, turn, grab the sleeve, come in, side control, cross face, bam. Okay, so that is that is a, a, a good deep half guard escape that I, I really like and I, I want you guys to look over. We'll get into more of a series later on. There's a lot of deep half guard escapes we can go over.